I am making a gingerbread house. I am doing so because it is my project for my Psychology of Women class. We were supposed to make some sort of artistic project that would fit within a 3x3 three three foot space. And it had to, you know, relate to women somehow. Relate to the class, basically. So, I mean, I, I thought about drawing a picture, but that's really boring, and I'm pretty sure most of the class drew pictures or made collages or cut out newspaper ads and stuck them on something. And I didn't want to do that. I wanted to make a gingerbread house. Here's one of my little people. Uh, not really sure if it's a man or a woman, but it's a person. It's a gun, gumdrop, licorice, toothpick person. I'm bored. Mila ditched me. I got her her own candy, or gingerbread house, and she decided to take it to her friend's house to spend the night and make over there because she doesn't have school tomorrow. Which, you know, it benefits me because I do have school tomorrow and she would have had to either go with me or stay by herself. So, I guess it's good in that way, but... It, you know, I kind of got two of them so we could do them together, but whatever. I'm used to being dished at this point, and I'm also used to being alone. Oh, poor me, oh, my life is so sad. Okay. So, my idea uh, was to make the house pink. Because pink is the universe, well, in this country, it's the universal symbol for female. Um, and blue, of course, is for male because, you know, that's all there is. Well, actually, I think what purple is the symbol for transgender. So here's, here's some blue. The blue is going to be everywhere outside of the house. Well, you know, the house itself. And so that's, that's the man's territory is working outside the house. Where the woman's territory is the house and inside. That's that's about as far as I got in my thought process as far as uh, how it relates to the class. I mean, you know, hey, I, I thought it was a pretty good idea, but it took me, you know, basically this whole term to think of it. It's due tomorrow, so um, yeah, I'm going to start painting the house. And you got these awesome little uh, minty pastel thingies, pink ones of course, going on top. I love these things, I'm really going to eat half of them. So if I randomly start singing, uh, don't be alarmed, I do that without even thinking about it. I mean, I'll literally be walking down the street in the middle of Portland, downtown Portland and singing with my headphones on. I don't really know what I sound like when I have my headphones on, but it's probably not good. That's not true. I can carry a tune. She's kind of freaky. She's kind of weird. She's kind of freaky. I don't know. I think she's a It's very, very pink. I don't know if you can see quite how pink it is on this video, but... Ooh, it is pink. Just to add a little bit of something, you know, not just the pink. Uh, there it is. I like uh, it. It's not pink. Now it's looking at me. Looking at me in that way. It says I've got swirls in my eyes for you. I'm not even high. Ooh, I should fix that. Alright, I'll show you the, the front door. I'm not gonna make a back door, you know. It's a little too much easy access. Isn't that pretty? It's so pink. Wow. It's kind of disturbing, actually. have our blue and our pink. It's kind of giving me a headache to look at it, actually, but 
Kind of a contrast. I guess that's what I'm going for. Now I need to figure out uh, the details. Like, uh, the outside has to be the masculine area. Oh, I should make like a little tool bench or something. Oh, a car. Definitely gotta put a car in here. Uh, I don't know why I'm gonna get a car, but I'll find one. We gotta put... Well, a woman inside, obviously. So she can go in there. Um... Yeah. Thought I'd, you know, get a better view. I know everyone is oh so interested in the production of my oppression house. So here we have um, a man, I guess. Um, not toothpicks, just to prop him up. <coughs> Sorry, I'm choking on licorice. Um, yeah, I'm eating my candy. What? Here's his car. <laughs> Awesome. Um, yeah, I made it out of a Tiger's Milk Bar and some shitty Palmer's Halloween candy. So, um, we have that. I, 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 I couldn't find anything better for the car. I tried. Um, no, maybe I'll add some more details to it when it dries, but whatever. So, we have our man. I'm not quite sure how I'm going to differentiate... Ooh! Idea! Okay. Alright. So we got our man. He has blue hair now. Short hair. Because that's the man. The man's got short hair. He ain't no bitch. There's the bitch! She's got pink hair. And it's long and you can't really see it in the back. But it is. Take my word for it. Or don't. Fuck you. And I also added some purple sprinkles to her pretty pink floor. That's, uh, the couch back there, I guess. Yeah. I got a big bag of marshmallows. I had to do something with them. So uh, I think I'm also going to add a baby. Because the mommy should be in there taking care of the baby while the daddy just, uh, goes out for a beer with the boys. Ugh. Shit. So I've added some bushes. You can see them. Aren't they awesome? I use blue frosting, so I guess that makes them men. I have to say that, uh... This is definitely, like, the best final I've ever had in my college career. Which has been extensive. Uh... I'm not done. Yeah, I mean, as far as finals go, it's... Pretty fucking awesome. I don't have to take a test. It's creative. Uh, my back hurts and it's taken longer than any final I've ever taken before, but it's fun though. I'm, I'm enjoying myself. Here is uh, my finished house of oppression. We should give them names. This shall be Jim. This is Jim. He's the man of the house. Who's talking to you, Bumpy? Here's Donna. And there, I added a baby. So there's their little baby. It's a girl. She has pink hair. Um, there's baby Lisa. That's original, huh? Here's their, their beautiful pink house. With their blue yard and their brown car. And that's it. That's that's my final. Well, I have to write up a little thing explaining how it relates to class and what it is. But I'll probably end up doing that tomorrow. So that that's my final. That's my awesome gingerbread house. That's got to be the one of the coolest gingerbread houses I've ever made. Um, hopefully you enjoyed watching me bumble around with it and uh, listening to me ramble. I'm good at rambling when I'm by myself.
I really don't talk when I'm around people, it's kind of weird. I talk more to myself than I do to other people, I think. It's not creepy.